As most of you already know, the new season just dropped this morning, and with that came an amazing new 2v2 map called Trench. In this map, there's a lot of weird easter eggs, and that's going to be what today's video is all about. I'm going to be showing you how to open this bunker, and also maybe a few things outside of the map that you probably haven't seen. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get this video started. So what you need to open this vault is a five digit code, and I'm going to tell you exactly where all five numbers are around the map but just make sure you go in the order that I go. So the first one is over here by the cement blocks. It is right in the corner. Don't pay attention to what my numbers are because all numbers are different in every match. So your numbers that you find will be different than mine. So don't pay attention to the code that I enter in. The next one is by this barrel in the corner. Like I said, mine was number three. Yours is gonna probably be a different number. Um, but the third digit is on the left side of the map. It's in this box, and so you're gonna have to look inside the box to find the number. And like I said, left side of the map in that little corner. Your fourth digit is gonna be over here in the cement structure. You're gonna have to go to the other end of it to find the number. And that is where you'll find your fourth number. Now it's on to the fifth number. The fifth number is under this wooden bridge-like structure, and that is the final number you have. Now you will head over to the vault, where you will enter the code with your weapon by shooting the digits in which you found them. Now if you put in the right code, the vault should beep, and then continue to open. Now when you start to head into the vault, you're going to see some pretty weird things. The main thing is that at this table, you've got all of these teddy bears sitting around it, and what looks like they're plotting for war. I can't be for certain that that's what it looks like. They're moving all these little stuffed animals on this map. And then there's this door at the other end. And I was wondering if I could get in that somehow. I wasn't for sure. So I decided to just start messing around in this in this vault. So I saw these all these phones and they had these digits on them. So I decided I'd enter the digits into the phone with my gun like we did to open the vault. That didn't do anything. So I then went and entered the digits up here after I entered them into the phone. And then the machine beeped. So I was wondering if I did something right. So I went to check and see if the door opened. But the phone was ringing. So I decided I'd answer the phone. And then the alarm started going off. And so I was wondering what was in it, and then I saw this teddy bear, so I kind of backed up. And then I started shooting at some miniguns. So this bear has two miniguns like you would get from a juggernaut. And it's all dressed up in armor. And then I was like, okay, maybe I can go in there. And then it exploded. And the door shut. But that isn't the only easter egg I found on this map. Outside of the map, when you go into spectator mode, I found three goats all around a stuffed elephant. Now, I don't know if this means anything. I, It's kind of weird. I don't really understand why there'd be three goats and a stuffed elephant. I'm not sure. But then I go to the other side of the map, and there's another goat in this broken down structure. I don't know if this means anything, really. Um, but if you guys know, tell me in the comments. Other than that, that's pretty much what I got in today's video. Thanks for watching. Uh, go drop a like. Hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next one.